Hey there, Props to History here once again at Prop Store with my friend Chuck of Prop Store. And I have a sword in my hands that's from an obscenely famous scene in film history, don't I? Uh, I might, you might say it was one of three films, uh, at, at least, that people think about when they think about this character. It's, it's in, indie, indie, indie and He Jones? might be coming back, Indiana yeah. Jones? yeah. There's a fifth movie about to come yeah, out. About, about that, yeah. This is the Grail Knight sword. This is. This, from, from the third movie, from yes. From the third movie, uh, The Last Crusade. This is the Crusader Knight at the end when they find the Grail. This is the sword that he tries to strike Indy with and then presents to him because he is he has been vanquished by Indy. Yes. A very strangely dressed knight, if I recall. And, and what's interesting is, as you can attest to, it's a pretty heavy sword, which made it very realistic yeah, for the it's, actor, it's, Robert Edison, to, to have to yield this. And it's, it, it's in remarkable shape, considering it's probably, we believe, it was a commercially available sword that they just... Yeah, I think it's possible, and this is a little bit of speculation, is that uh, this doesn't appear to be something that was custom made for the film, but maybe they purchased this. Uh, but it has all the details that they were looking for. Mm -hmm. You know, it's gold, it sort of says of the time frame, it could have gone through the, uh, the Spanish Inquisition. And, um, you know, it's also heavy for that, that famous scene where he struggles to he actually struggles get it up. lift it, yeah, yeah. no, that's... Absolutely great. And this is this is another piece that's coming up for auction at the end of this month, isn't it? Yes. Uh, this will actually go under the hammer on June the 28th. You can, and the auction goes from June 28th through the 30th. And we're actually going to be at the Peterson Automotive Museum live, so you can see the bidding, which is an event in and of itself. Oh, yeah, absolutely. But uh, every time I come here to Prop Store, I get to handle these amazing pieces from film history. And occasionally it dawns on me, oh, yeah, that's that thing from that <laughs> scene. And this is one of those moments again where... I'm realizing that that is this sword that survived in kind of a weird way because it was just from one person to the next. Yeah, so the actor Robert Edison had uh, gifted this to another actor, Tony Church. Uh, he'd stayed with him, and now we're actually auctioning it to you so it can be in your possession. Chuck, thank you so much. Hey, my pleasure. Props to history.